Hello, boys and girls, my name is Altsy, and welcome back to Belt Last Factorio, where last time we uh, fixed uh, our mall here, so now we produce everything. Uh, at least if uh, the materials are there. Seems like we are lacking a bit of uh, steel at the moment. And more importantly, we set up uh, this cozy little station so we can get a bit of uh, cliff explosive out of it. And today we will start off with um, redoing these factories. Uh, I think at the stone smeltery we can rip out here and actually have another stone field there where we also directly smelt then and then we can uh, move some of the other factories that are in a, a small square to a big square uh, and eventually we will get to everything so we only have big squares and I am thinking that maybe here on this level we will have uh, an open an open space. Um, so let's count the squares. This one would be square. This one would be square. So we would have here a square. So it could be this row or uh, this row that that we leave open so we can really have the main traffic horizontally going through here in the middle and then maybe on somewhere here have a main horizontal one that should help with uh, what we need but I think we do have two uh, factories for low density structures so let's remove one and re reuse that space um, to be more productive what are you waiting for iron plate pickup okay have it your way so if we go over to this one and we just say we disconnect the, the input lines and then We should be able to wait this out, uh, hopefully, if not, we can always uh, move things uh, to chests, but I think uh, we need to remove uh, this solar panel array that will be uh, in the way. And then once everything is removed here, uh, we can actually set up a three item input factory for low density structures. And that should be uh, more efficient than the factory that we currently have here so that I can uh, remove the second one over there and use that plot for something else uh, and we will move uh, along that way until we have um, refactored every small factory in a big one uh, we probably will be left with uh, some waiting base some um, fueling stations uh, that 
but we can send to those around here in the middle where we will have anyway a bit of uh, space to go through all right uh, let me do this this first uh, this first square here and then we will see where the journey takes us while waiting here for the low density structures to be picked up we can maybe uh, head down to our stone uh, stone brick smeltery uh, unhook there the delivery and uh, reposition that whole thing up to uh, to our stone field that we hook up the stone brick production right there where we have the stone and pick that up so where is the stone smelting I think it's down here somewhere is it not let's see on the map iron 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 uh, it's up there walked right past it so we will unhook the the stone delivery there and that should mean our stone consumption reduces drastically and we can then just use up the the stone bricks that we already have there and uh, maybe we don't yeah we will no longer need those trains because we will have uh, stations directly at the stone field also for stone bricks so looking at the map um, we are not using that many miners for the stone which indicates we probably do not need to go overboard uh, that big with uh, with the with the smelting array so i think if we uh, do it here on the on the right side that should be good and that should also uh, help with uh, with the setup for um, for our big layout because Basically, this would become then one big square. Once the stone patch is done there, which could still take a while. And as you can see, our um, low density structures are picked up. Uh, but basically, we only need it for the yellow science. Uh, and that is... Uh, hampered by the slow production of the green circuits so let's fix um, the uh, stone brick production and then uh, we will see uh, if we have already run out of low density structures or if we have to uh, uh, do something else while we wait on that to finish over on this side we possibly no not possibly uh, we have a few more of uh, these in here but I think uh, they are small enough in number that we can actually finish demolishing this one here on this side we are still 
in the process of producing some of the, the uh, low density structures, at least in some places. Um, I really want to get that out of the way um, so that um, we do not have to move all the ingredients over and here yeah now i can grab everything it's not that much anymore and then here i can then just place in another set of our factory blueprint uh, once i have cleared all this out uh, and then I think one factory should do at least for now um, uh, we need this one and we don't need that part there so it will take a while to set this up and um, during that time uh, this may run a while longer but then i think once that is uh, finished uh, we will place in here some gears so we can uh, get rid of these two um, we can then have uh, maybe grenades back here um, we can move the yellow um, ammunition as well as the sticks and the walls and uh, hopefully then we can also get rid of this one so we have only a few more factories that we have to move but one factory after another and now with our mall over here up and running uh, it should not be that a tedious task to get all the uh, materials that we need for such a build. The progress that we have here with a new gear factory, this is an old one, with a new grenade factory, a new wall factory, a new... Uh, iron sticks factory as well as a new pipe factory that's about 12 hours gameplay and the thing is that the we are only slowly draining here the uh, old uh, factories the items that we have stocked up uh, so it will be a while until we can hook up the new factories with uh, uh, deliveries and uh, I think uh, one of the main issues why that is is because we are not doing any research however research wise we also have only the yellow and the uh, um, uh, purple signs in this new setup but we need to uh, change the other threes as well so I think before starting in uh, with research I want to get uh, at least these two done uh, maybe even the red and the green one we can add them uh, down here i think uh, one two uh, there then we have one slot open here and maybe by that time um, some other slots have opened up uh, up there otherwise we also have some some squares here that we can that we can use and research wise I'm 
I want to go in the direction of uh, of Power Armor 3 uh, and then just uh, uh, damage there uh, not really going into uh, the area uh, where we would make uh, then real additional progress like with rocket control units uh, towards the towards the uh, rocket silo but uh, basically there are not that many uh, researches uh, uh, left uh, and I mean 300 400 that's not huge amounts of uh, uh, science packs that that we need artillery will be a bigger one with uh, 2000 uranium ammunition 1600 uh, at this point we have so many bottles uh, stocked up that uh, it will take a while until we drain it because we have trains sitting here that are almost all half full so uh, let's see about the restructuring of the remaining science factories uh, and then start up some science here in the middle we now have quite a few empty slots and uh, we have more factories here on top and also down below. All the science has been moved and refactored and what we are left here is mainly the smelting but we have still the art factory for the, the inserters. Then uh, over on uh, this side we have belts, electric motors. And then all this up here. And eventually we will also get to those. Uh, in the meantime, I was also able to almost put in the complete roundabout around here. So even with that, we should be good enough uh, to be able to deliver uh, the space science there. But this last piece, that's not far away. But let's now queue up a few more researches uh, so that we can get those, um, those resources and science packs uh, used up. And uh, that is then all for this episode. Um, not sure how long it actually is but it was quite long in the making uh, this is the fourth day uh, recording a segment and there was quite a bit of uh, game time uh, that went into it hope you enjoyed it and uh, join in next time for more beltless factory until then goodbye